Ann Steves, owner of Gorgeous Fabrics. Have you ever received a fabric that you didn't know what it was made of? It could have been a gift from a friend, or perhaps you acquired it at some wonderful estate sale, or maybe it's just been sitting in your stash so long you forgot. Well, there's an easy way to figure out what a fabric is made of. Burn it. Different fibers burn very differently, and you can tell by looking at what remains what was in the fabric to begin with. Now before we begin, please be sure to take proper precautions when dealing with an open flame. Always make sure to burn over a sink or a non-reactive surface like slate, marble, or as I'm doing here, a dish filled with water. You can't be too careful. Also, for safety's sake, never hold the fabric directly in your fingers. I use a tweezers or a hemostat which you can purchase at craft stores or medical supply stores. I also use a long neck lighter, like what you use for lighting candles, rather than matches or a cigarette lighter. Finally, I recommend keeping a fire extinguisher handy, just in case things get out of control. Now that we've got that out of the way, let's burn some fabric. Let's start with wool. Wool burns very slowly. It smells like burnt hair, yummy. My kids love that and they're not shy about complaining. Oh, mom, are you burning fabric again? Ugh. Wool also leaves behind a crumbly black ash. Next, let's light up the polyester. It's like the 70s all over again, disco inferno. Polyester is a petroleum-based product, so it burns steadily but not quickly. It leaves behind a hard plastic-like bead. Cotton is a plant-based fiber, so it burns as a plant would, and it leaves behind a soft black to brown ash. Rayon is a wood pulp-based fiber, so it burns quite readily, and it leaves behind a black to gray soft ash that's slightly more crumbly than cotton. Silk is a protein-based fiber, and it burns at a rapid, steady pace. It smells really bad to me, though my kids might argue otherwise. It leaves behind a crumbly black ash. So the next time you find yourself wondering, what is that gorgeous fabric made of? Take the guesswork out of it. Torch it. For the gorgeous fabrics used in this video and all of your fashion fabric needs, visit gorgeousfabrics.com.